all of the women of Aerial Development Group, I think, can equally say that we've been inspired by her and her ability to um, open up doors for us and encourage us to grow in our own roles of leadership in different areas and different communities throughout Nashville. We've grown together and we've learned together and I just love that you know she's taken a chance on me and she's given me leadership roles that I wouldn't have had anywhere else. And so I'm very blessed because of that. Her ability to give back and to serve others before herself always is what encourages me most. So outside of the real estate industry and outside of Ariel, like she's a huge part in a company, Horizon Initiative, that is supporting children in need overseas. And that's her passion and that's why she got in this business in the first place. I think that in, a, in itself is a true inspiration. vocal about my opinion that women in business shouldn't really promote the fact that they're a woman in business. They want to be seen as an entrepreneur. And what I've loved about Brittany is that she is a woman operating in a man's world and yet she never uses that card. She just is trying to be the very best developer in Nashville. A, a really captivating part of, of Brittany's story is that she founded the company to support orphanages in Africa. That is a really important part of who she is and how uh, vital she is to the Nashville community too and her efforts to give back uh, internationally and locally. One of the things that makes Brittany uh, stand out to me is her hunger and thirst for knowledge. I see her in a room of other entrepreneurs and she is soaking up every word they say and digesting it to use later. And that's just a great trait of a leader to be a really good listener and to learn. Brittany, the committee thinks the whole world should be watching you. <laughs>